Hi, my name is Darius. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm testing Xiaomi 11T Pro. It's going to be a busy day today, so I have a plenty of time to check video quality, take some pictures, do some time lapse, slow mo, see if it's good for vlogging. Call me down. Right, so this is front facing camera, shooting uh, 1080p 60 frame, frames per second at the moment. A shame there's no 4K. Well, the quality seems to be right and stabilization too. I don't do any external microphone, so all you can hear is actually coming from this device. Right, so this is dual uh, mode camera. And we are about to go horse riding, Kara, aren't we? Do you like horse riding? Mm. No? Yeah. Yeah, so we're gonna have lots of fun. So we are just about to uh, yeah. approach the farm. Yeah. And we're gonna have lots of fun. So then yeah. I've got a chance to do some slow motion, uh, take more pictures, and uh, to see what's the quality like. So stay tuned to see more. Shall we go and get the boys from school? Yeah? Let's go. Okay, so this is ultra wide angle. Let's check stabilization and the quality. So 1080p, 30 frames per second only. And let me do some running to check stabilization. Okay, that's pretty good to be honest. Okay, let's switch to the main sensor now. Okay, I can shoot up to 8K, which is now 30 frames per second. But the stabilization is really bad, as you can see. Very shaky, so I wouldn't really recommend uh, walking around with it. Let's try 4K 60. Okay, so this is stabilization like. Yeah, it's definitely a lot better than 8K. And let's do some running. Now I'm going to check out of focus. It is pretty fast to be honest. Please remember I don't do any color grading on my footage or use any uh, gimbal. So all you can see is actually coming from this device without any stabilization at all. Let's take some uh, pictures and see what's the quality. Also, I'll be doing some slow motion too.
now it's time to check macro modes so this is the video 1080p 30 frames per second and you can see it's losing its focus so I'm gonna lock it there we are and take some pictures now That's it for today, hope you enjoyed this episode. I'm not really sure about this device. I'm a little bit disappointed because I was hoping uh, to get optical image stabilization, especially uh, this Mi 11T is a pro version. Um, so yeah, also ultra wide angle should only 1080p when uh, you can actually get 4K on uh, mid-range devices such as uh, OnePlus Nord 2. But I'm hoping to uh, compare this device with Poco F3 uh, which I think we can get a very similar um, results, but it's actually half of the price of this uh, Mi 11 T Pro. Hope you enjoyed this episode, and I'll catch you in the next one. Cheers. Yeah.